Yo, what's up everybody? It's your granddad Ayo and the growth doesn't stop. Welcome to the Growth Family if you're here for the first time and welcome back Growth Family. It's good to be here. It's good to see you. So in this video, we are talking about the cycle of self-doubt and how to break it. Before we start, just a quick disclaimer. I'm not a life coach. I just know a few things. Anytime you tried something new and failed or just wasn't the best, you kept on going. You kept on trying. But at some point, someone told you you're not good enough, that you can't do something, so you shouldn't do it. You was made to feel that you shouldn't attempt things where your success isn't guaranteed. It might have been a stranger, teacher, parent, or a sibling. Eventually, you let their words become your thoughts. These new thoughts of yours pop up anytime. Anytime you want to do something and your success isn't guaranteed and failure is possible. The more you doubt yourself because of bad experiences, the more you will fail because you doubt yourself. Every experience impacts your mindset. Your mindset impacts your actions and your actions impact your experiences we cannot directly control our experiences but we can control and change our mindsets with persistence keep telling yourself that your bad experiences do not define you tell yourself over and over again that you will exceed all fears and limitations in your way Remind yourself that the potential reward is far, 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 far greater than any detriment a temporary failure will cause you. Learn to be kind to yourself and stick up for yourself. If you fall and hurt yourself, tell yourself it's okay. You'll get there eventually. If you fall and people laugh, tell them so what? At least you're brave enough to attempt something you might fail. If we use sheer brute force alone, then I believe that our willpower is enough to overcome our self-doubt. Not by abusing ourselves, no, 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 no. But every time we realize we're being held back by the shackles of self-doubt, we have to say F that and push forward even more. Tell ourselves that we can do this tell ourselves that we can win and nobody gives a toss if we fail we all face so many obstacles in our life and even more if you come from certain environments so why the heck are we going to put even more obstacles in the way of achieving what we want it's illogical it doesn't make sense let's begin to make our lives easier by releasing ourselves from the shackles of self-doubt and by walking the path of self-belief. We believe, we visualize, we act how we would carry ourselves as if we did believe in ourselves. That's how we start to have better experience. Better experiences gives us a better mindset. Once we have a better mindset, that will give us better actions and better actions lead us to having better experiences. It's a cycle. We must take action that puts us outside of our comfort zone, that, that leaves us no choice but to believe in ourselves in all aspects of our lives. I wanna make one last thing clear before I close up today. Everybody has self-doubt. It's impossible to remove completely. Like impossible everybody hesitates at something however it's when we let our self-doubt rule us when it's a problem when we let it paralyze us stopping us from doing the things we want to do that is what we're working to overcome and that is what we will overcome that's it for today grow family make sure you like comment and subscribe it helps me a lot share the video people need to see this Let's get it out there, man. Let's go. I will be back next week at 6 a.m. on a Monday morning GMT. Peace.